Our story begins with Nomura enrolling in an academy where girls typically rule. The highest ranking girls are Rin, Mary, Tsukuyo, Murabi, and Satori also known as the Five Swords. They gathered to discuss their upcoming problem, which was Nomura. He basically caused quite a stir in his previous academy by single-handedly knocking out 40 guys, so he was transferred here for discipline. But the strange thing about this school was that the girls basically forced every guy in the school to become a manly girl by acting and even applying makeup like a girl. But Nomura paid no attention to it, and so Rin was the one who was waiting for him in his class. So she told him to dress and behave like a girl, but not like our protagonist, so he tried to flee. However, Rin began pursuing him, and she eventually took this rule too seriously. This rule was made to protect the girl from crazy male delinquents. To keep those delinquents in check, those five authority figures were given special permission to carry a weapon with them at all times. She attempted to fight Nomura with that sword, and while doing so, she managed to scar him. As things became more serious, Nomura wore his sword-resistant hand gloves. While doing it, Rin thought she had the upper hand on Nomura, but just as she thought she had him, Nomura used his bullet technique to knock her out. But, for some reason, she knew the name of that technique, and Nomura was curious as to where she learned that. However, because Nono misread the situation and hit Nomura in the back, he ended up kissing Rin. After that incident, she developed a high fever, and Nomura felt bad or something about that day, and one of his newly made friends, Kusuo, happened to know a smuggler for his request. Then, the other day, Nomura crept into the girl's dorm to meet Rin, and because she had a fever, he bought some cakes for her. She was now falling for Nomura because he had taken one off her the first time and looking at her lovely face Nomura desired to see her lovely face every day. With all of this flirting, he eventually asked for permission to leave the academy. However, this is possible if all five girls stamp the card. Nomura wanted to repay her kindness with a kiss, but she became flustered, while saving her FR falling, Nono misread the situation. So, while fleeing from that messed up situation, another problem appears. Kuka, the little sister of one of the five Mary. She wanted to take matters into her own hands to discipline Nomura, but Nono also wanted to do this for herself. Even so, both of them combined are no match for Nomura, and they ended up believing that Nomura might do something perverted and began crying. So everyone assumed that Nomura is even getting his hands on little girls to do perverted things, so now Rin personal started supervising him. But then the other day Mary now wanted some payback from Nomura that he laid his hands on her little sister. So now that Rin is his boss, Mary is powerless to act and this was all a misunderstanding to begin with. Even so, Mary began her fight with Rin, and Nomura was left to deal with Kuka, and while doing so, Nomura used his belt to defend herself from her leash, but this had an effect that may prove that he was a pervert. So he was hiding his junk when he saw Amu. In the past, Amu had wanted Nomura to join the gang, but he flatly refused. So for information, Nomura thought she was Ahi back then, and Amu completely screwed him up. He tried to talk to her, but his junk was still out, so while taking this chance, she disappeared. Then, at that time, Mary arrived, leaving Rin behind, and they both went away fighting, so it was obvious that Nomura would win against her. But, knowing how perverted Nomura was, she expected him to do some forbidden things to her as well, giving her the perfect opportunity to expel him. But even as she was making him an offer he didn't want, Nomura just wanted that stamp so he could enter and leave school but keep it for another time. So Mary's attitude towards him shifted and she began to like him, just like Rin. While this was going well for Nomura because two of the five swords were falling for him, another problem appeared, her name is Warabi. Seeing these two, Rin and Mary, adoring a man, she devised a strategy to get them back on track. She announced the sports challenge for Nomura, Rin, and Mary with the permission of the school council. And because Nomura wasn't interested, she hung up on his one and only friend, effectively forcing Nomura to play her little game. And their first test was a summoning match, and it will be of the three and three, with Warabis minion also taking part in this so-called three musketeers. But Nomura appears to be fine and even put on the summo belt, implying that Nomura had no problems and that they could participate. But Nomura appears to be fine and even put on the summo belt, so Nomura had no problem and without it they participate. So Rin and Mary had no choice but to take help from Nomura to put it on, and honestly it was kind of fun for him. So Warabus minions now pull a prank and force Warabus bear to fight in the sumo match. So Nomura stands up to face that bear Kyubu, and the whole thing is being broadcast live on the school television. So Nomura used his ultimate bullet technique right from the start, but it had no effect. So, for his next attempt, he grabbed Kyubu and tried to throw him out, 
But Nomura noticed something and did some and backed off. He did this by removing the Sumo belt, and as a result, Nomura won the first round. For the second round, they received nothing because seeing their strongest player lose made her upset. So she turned this into a siege battle, with Nomura attempting to reach the rooftop by overcoming all obstacles in his path. She, like the rest of the girls, would give him her stamp as a permission stamp to enter and leave the school grounds. Then Rin and Mary decide to participate in this with Nomura as well, so they wanted to accompany him. So No No and Kuka went ahead and cleared as many girls as they could. But when they met Satori, one of the Academy's five swords, Nomura had a hard time determining whether she was on his side based on her odd behavior. Aside from that, some masked girls freed Kusuo, and Nomura went to the rooftop with Rin and Mary to confront Warabi. But she wanted her bear to have a partner as well as land, and there were still other girls left. So Mary was dealing with the girls and the three musketeers, Rin was opposing Warabi, and Nomura was once again fighting the bear. And for the time being, that bear was giving Nomura a run for his money because he knew boxing's corner Nomura, but the bullets continued attack that already made him weak. So Nomura had a perfect shot at it, while Mary took care of the remaining girls. And Rin had a difficult time dealing with Warabi because she was fighting Rin in a ninja style. Even so, Rin is known as the Demon Princess because of her strength, and she also defeated Warabi, who is now lost. Warabi also stamps Nomura's freedom card as part of the agreement. So, after that day, Mary and Rin were so taken with Nomura that Rin changed her outfit and Mary changed her perfume. For Nomura to take notice. But it appears that Nomura didn't notice how much effort they put in, but at school, every girl was now after Nomura no matter where he went or what he did. Then, at night, when Nomura passed out, something happened. Then, during a routine checkup, Rin discovered a photo of Nomura and Tauri naked, and Nomura went into pitch again, and was chased down by Rin and Mary. But Warabi appeared out of nowhere to assist, and when Nomura explained his situation, Warabi seemed to be on his side to clear his name from this misunderstanding. Nomura purposefully got caught by Rin and Mary and was about to be punished, but after seeing his deadly scar, they backed off to give him some time to rest. During that time, Nomura escaped with the help of Warabi to retrieve the data of that photo from Satori's place in the girl's dorm. So, while they got nothing, Warabi thought it might be in the girl's bath, which is when one of the Satori's girls tried to put them away. While on it, Satori also got out of the bath, and the thing around her neck was somewhat suspicious. And all of this effort was to separate Nomura from Rin and Mary because they were guarding him, and who knows what she has in store for him after that. For this plan to succeed on the inside, this guy Kusuo was also a part of the scandal because he allowed Satori to enter Nomura's room and take naked pictures of them. So, how will things turn out while this scandal hangs around Nomura's neck?